Have you ever wondered if extinct species could be brought back to life? Well, scientists have achieved something remarkably similar with a 32,000-year-old plant. Picture this, the Pleistocene epoch, a period marked by glaciers and mammoths and an unsuspecting plant, its seeds tucked away in the burrows of a ground squirrel in northeastern Siberia, waiting. Fast forward to the present, and these seeds, the oldest ever to be resurrected, have given rise to a living, breathing plant. This isn't just any plant. It's one that has defied the odds, a testament to the resilience of life itself. And it's not just a carbon copy of its ancient self. When it flowered, it revealed longer and more widely spaced petals, a subtle yet fascinating divergence from its modern counterparts. And the seeds? They boasted a 100% germination success rate, a feat almost unheard of in the plant world. This incredible resurrection story isn't just about a single plant, it's a beacon of hope, a hint at the tantalizing possibility of resurrecting extinct species in the future. So how did scientists manage to breathe life into these ancient seeds? Let's find out. Imagine stumbling upon an ancient treasure, not of gold or gems, but of life itself. That's exactly what happened in northeastern Siberia. Nestled in the icy grip of the permafrost, scientists discovered something extraordinary. Seeds. Not just any seeds, though. These were relics from a time long past, remnants of the Pleistocene epoch, some 32,000 years ago. These seeds were found in the most unexpected of places, frozen ground squirrel burrows. These industrious little creatures had unwittingly become the guardians of a time capsule, preserving these ancient seeds in their frosty homes. As the millennia passed, the world evolved and changed. But in the heart of the permafrost, these seeds lay dormant, their potential for life locked away. The recovery of these seeds was a feat in itself, requiring meticulous care and precision. Every seed was a priceless artifact, a tiny window into a world we can only imagine. And yet, the true marvel of this discovery lay not in the age of the seeds, but in what they held within. For within these seeds was a secret, a secret that had the potential to completely rewrite our understanding of plant life. But these seeds were not just old, they held a secret that would challenge what we know about plant life. Just having the seeds was not enough. The real challenge was to make them grow. And guess what? They succeeded. As we delve into the journey of these seeds, we find that our scientists didn't just stop at discovery. No, they took it a step further. They cultured adult plants from the placental tissue and grew not one, not two, but 36 specimens. But the surprises didn't stop there. When these plants flowered, they revealed a unique trait. Their petals were longer and more widely spaced than their modern counterparts of Silene stenophylla, commonly known as the narrow-leafed campion a subtle yet fascinating departure from their contemporary version. And here's the real kicker. Every single one of these seeds germinated. Yes, you heard that right, a 100% germination success rate. Quite remarkable, isn't it? This breakthrough not only proves that life can be resilient, but also opens up a world of possibilities for the resurrection of extinct species. So the next time you see a flower, remember, it might just be a living piece of history. If you enjoyed this video, like and join our earthly mission by hitting the subscribe button below.